here at UVA, our ophthalmology residency program really aims to graduate comprehensive, well-trained ophthalmologists. So we hope that the minute our residents leave here, if they want to go straight into a practice setting, it's a really easy transition. And if they choose to go on to further training, they're well equipped to train in any subspecialty area. This program really attracts extremely bright and extremely talented residents who are just very interested in learning. The backbone of the residency program, which makes it such a strong place to be for three years, is that we still have a resident-run clinic with continuity of care where they have their own patients and can care for them for three years. Being a product of this residency program, I know how important it is to be able to care for patients over a period of time. From day one, you get your own resident clinic where your name is on the door and the patients walk in expecting to see you from the very beginning and you do everything for them. You're their doctor, you diagnose them, you treat them, and then they follow up with you, whether it's three months, six months, or a year. And it really provides good continuity of care um, and you get to build relationships with these patients. The resident-run clinic is just amazing. I think that that kind of springboards you into independence as a practitioner. Um, you really have to take ownership of your patients. There's sort of a very logical progression of autonomy. There's always backup, always coverage for complicated patients that come in, but when you're doing your residency, you want to be able to eventually start making your own decisions about patients. We value surgical training significantly. So while we do spend a lot of time in the clinic, probably 40 to 50% of training is spent in the operating room as well. So the residents rotate through all of our different clinics. I have a refractive surgery clinic, an ocular surface disease clinic, and they come stay with me. They go watch me do surgery. They participate in the surgery. When we're in the operating room, you're not just observing me operate. You're going to have the opportunity to do it. And we do that piecemeal. There are certain parts of the case that you begin to do once you're comfortable with them. We'll go on to the next stage of the case. If we need to spend more time on one of those stages, we have weeks and weeks to, to do that together. We start surgery as a second year, or a PGY-3. We finish with well over 200 cataracts. We also have access to very experienced glaucoma surgeons that you can sign up cases with. We have very experienced retina faculty as well. The breadth of clinical education and exposure that residents get here is really remarkable and is great for training. They get to see 10 years worth of diseases in only three or four years and, and really get a, a very solid clinical foundation from being able to see so many different things. One of the things that really sets us apart is that we have our own standalone resident clinic where you manage your own patients, you have your own schedule, the patients come back to you for follow-up for the three years that you're in our program, um, and you manage those patients alongside attending supervision for trainees within our department. We have four residents in the ophthalmology residency program each year. We have one retina fellow who's here for two years. We have a glaucoma fellow. And then we have one optometry resident. A residency in optometry allows a graduating optometrist that could go right into private practice and give them more training in a structured educational environment. And so basically, it makes good optometrists better. They've graduated optometry school, and they now already know what niche, what field they want to work in. And so what's pretty neat is we can help them grow that niche, um, whether it's specialty contact lenses, uh, to ocular disease, to pediatrics, to whatever they want. We have a relatively small department, and so the residents and the attendings know each other well. None of the residents are gonna go unnoticed or slip under the radar. All the residents work with each faculty member. Most have each faculty member's cell phone number and call and text whenever they have a question or concern. I love my relationships with my faculty. Every single person here has been so incredibly supportive and so incredibly approachable, and I've never felt lesser for not knowing the answer to something. 
constantly texting them when I see a patient that if it's somebody that has a corneal issue, I'll text one of our corneal attendings and say, hey, do you mind if I just chat with you really quickly and talk over this case? I'd really love your opinion on it. So they're all very supportive and eager to teach and really rooting for your success. Well, I think the feel here is um, very much a family. I think that the culture at UVA is really special. Really, it's the people that make the department. Coming from the chair down, it's just a very friendly sort of collegiate environment, which makes a difference when you're a trainee. Very supportive of each other. When someone gets sick or someone needs something, all the other residents stand up and help. I've loved working with my fellow residents. I think that's one of my favorite parts of the program. I feel like all of us get along really well together. We do a lot of stuff outside of work, hangouts on the weekends and going out to dinner. It's a really fun group to be a part of. I think Charlottesville has everything you need and nothing you don't. It's got a nice city feel without all of the negative aspects of a big city. Oh, I, I love Charlottesville because I can get in my car and in 10 minutes I can be in my office. I used to live in New York City and it used to take me an hour and a half to drive the same distance. Imagine finding three hours every day that you're not in your car. There is a lot of culture in Charlottesville. There's no shortage of it with a university that's as large as UVA and that's exciting. You know, it's in the mountains, so you're really close to a lot of beautiful national parks. It's two hours from D.C., so it's really easy to go there for a weekend. And then the restaurant scene is absolutely fantastic here. I think applicants should strongly consider this program because they will be well clinically trained with excellent surgical volume, access to great equipment, in an environment that makes it a good place to learn. I think our program draws residents and candidates who really value patient care, who really want to do the best work clinically and surgically that they can, and who are really patient focused. I think we have a perfect residency. The educational opportunities and environment are just so rich. Training will leave here being an excellent ophthalmologist. There's no doubt about that. The environment is very warm and supportive, and one would really enjoy being a part of our family. It's hard to imagine a better training environment and program than we have here.